Okay, so uh, we, we recently had a contest following, um, following our release of Raspberry Pi builds to see what our users could do uh, in terms of using your Raspberry Pi for fun projects. Um, this is Espen, and Espen, maybe you want to just say what this is. Yes, this is my, uh, well, I guess contribution for this competition. It's a coffee monitoring solution, I guess for uh, yeah, uh, figuring out how many cups of coffee left you have in your uh, coffee pot uh, based on Raspberry Pi and a weight cell. And uh, yeah, it's a very crude prototype, I guess, but uh, hopefully ready for production soon. Looks good. Okay, so yeah. a lot of people said that they were gonna um, do stuff. And to be honest, I didn't know if any of them would, so it's really good to see that you actually did something. Were you planning to do this anyway? Yes. Okay, that's fine. I that's fine. <laughs> yeah. and just remind me, and I guess anyone who's watching this, exactly what this is and what it's supposed to do. Yes. So this is, well, uh, an advanced coffee monitoring unit, I guess. Uh, you can call it that. So uh, how it works, or it's based on uh, what is called a weight cell, which mm -hmm. is this thing here. And the base, it just works by measuring weight, basically, how much mm -hmm. thing you weigh. And uh, it's wired up to uh, the Raspberry using the analog ports, of course, and a small LCD display, so we can uh, take a reading. Yeah. And uh, the idea here is that you sort of... It's quite big as it is, this is an early prototype, of course. But the idea is to have a sort of small discrete plate, mm -hmm. like this. And you put your coffee mug or coffee pot on top of it, and it will measure basically how much it weighs. And based on some calibration, it would know how many cups of coffee is left in this coffee pot. So, uh, and over time, of course, it will monitoring this and uh, send uh, send data back to wherever you want it. And uh, you'd add some thresholds, of course, for when it will mon or alert you to when uh, levels are getting low, for instance. Right? Mm. So, say after when it's three cups left, then it's time to like. It's getting need, critical. Yes, yeah. you need more. <laughs> so then it will. The, the idea is to send some push message to some. Slack server or something. <laughs> Slack integration as well. Yes, yeah. of course. <laughs> and it, it's, a, it's a Pi Zero. Yes. So to send this data, what are you doing? You're, what, what kind of thing are you have? Well, currently it's just a prototype, so it doesn't okay. actually it doesn't send, send anything. Just have of course. The but the, the, this is the uh, Zero W, I guess, which okay. has the wireless built in. So uh, it's trivial to set up some, just integrate some APIs from Slack or Discord or whatever you hmm. want to use. Yeah. So yeah. So the entire thing runs on Python, of course, uh, since that's easier to work with, <laughs> and it's fast enough. So why not? And uh, yeah, again, integration with other services through Python is yeah trivial. So it's yeah, you can happily integrate it to uh, whatever you need. Yeah, you could also run a web server on the thing. Yeah, yeah. So we can <laughs> display it on the web server. Display yeah. Display page. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 Okay. What do we do? Do we ping this and you, you show it? Yes, so this is calibrated for this. It's okay. 10 deciliters and it should be 10 cups readout okay. on this. So let's see if this. It doesn't have to, I don't have to fill the whole thing, but. I should just demonstrate the, the 5 maybe. Yeah. Okay. okay. A bit more, but. Okay. So if we do this, this should hopefully now. Yes. Yeah. Five cups. Five cups. Five cups. Uh -huh. And right. then uh, as it goes down, you just send it back to, to wherever. Yes. So <laughs> if we try pouring this, I guess it's, I can try to get it down to the threshold right away. So we don't, if we do three, yeah. it's yeah. a bit below. Aha. Uh -huh. Three cups. So you see at the top there, and it says now the low warning. <laughs> okay. Which is the uh, the threshold for yeah. uh, for, uh, and that's of course you can change this to whatever yeah. you need. But um, and then and I can pour the rest of it out as well. But yeah. But once it goes out, it just says this, right? It doesn't have a like state for empty mug. But uh, that's again very easy to add. And uh, why the coffee thing? You're a coffee fan. Yes. Yeah. Yes, very much. So it's <laughs> <So laughs> the most obvious choice. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And it's it's based on the need basically in our office because uh, this is a big problem for us that uh, people take the last of the coffee and you know no one knows that it's empty and they get there before a meeting and 
to allow for them. I, I feel like you could register their badge or something as well, and then you I know, know who the person was. Yeah. <laughs> you took the last couple. Yeah. <laughs> Um, make some log in so you, you, you're, you're gonna actually use it you think hopefully hopefully like yeah again this is very good so that hopefully i would try to make some like the most important thing is to try to make this a bit more discreet i think it's going to be very like wide and yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's very it anyway. builds on the counter but if it was you can make it quite like lower to the ground and try to make it a bit bigger of course it needs mm. to fit whatever you're putting on top and then maybe try to integrate the screen and that as well. Like, I don't know. If yeah. you make the top plate acrylic, like this, is, you can sort of make it transparent and then mm -hmm. maybe integrate some screen underneath. I don't know. But yeah, the idea is to try to make a like, real thing we can actually have running in the office and yeah, see how it works <laughs> if it survives. I, I, I just uh, a bit to one side, but I'm curious now because actually I I don't have a, a Raspberry Pi Zero myself. I mean, you obviously. Yeah. Have you run Vivaldi on one of these? And uh, not on the Zero. Yeah, but I tried it on the three, and it was that's fine. fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's that's how I already use it. But uh, just have you tried it on the Zero? Uh, no, I haven't tried it on the Zero. Yeah. Uh, Still want to. I mean, it, theoretically, it works. Right? Yeah, it's but worth it. Has, <laughs> it's speed but it has a, a little bit. It's a, bit, it's a little bit low on memory. Yeah, um, exactly. So yeah. it might be a bit tight. But maybe you can open one tab. Yeah. <laughs>